Welcome to this uh, shortwave radio channel and uh, today we'll actually share a few resources that are on the web where you can have more information about you know different types of signals on the shortwave bands. Uh, one of the things we hear very often is the US Air Force high frequency global communication system. This is a, um, a, a service from the US Air Force that actually is often reported and we hear often the uh, what we call EAMs or emergency action messages which which are kind of coded messages that are sent through. Now of course decoding and knowing um, what these mean is pretty much impossible but there's one thing that's cool you know you're listening to the US military on the shortwave bands. Here there's a page on the uh, radioreference.com website which is um, I'll be sharing in the uh, description below the video just click the link about this system about um, and so you'll get more information about you know how all of this is working um, and get a little more information about the frequencies used and the primary frequencies uh, and backup frequencies also you have uh, schedules and times uh, for some of these when they are used mostly you also will have uh, information about the different uh, stations or frequencies that the stations used, uh, you know, like Andrews Air Force Base, Air Force Base or Ascension or Guam or Hawaii or whatever. Uh, so you got information here, which is nice because it gives you a lot of information about uh, basically who is using uh, these frequencies and uh, different stations. You also have AL frequency charts. So if you uh, hear some uh, automatic um, AL messages, ALE. Um, they are a type of, uh, of digital signal. You can see the different stations using this and so on and the frequencies assigned to their services. Remember that this is um, this list is probably a few years old but you know overall it doesn't change too much so you can check this out. Uh, the frequencies that I see here have pretty much all been monitored uh, even here at my place so most of the time uh, from, from what I know most of these frequencies are still being used and um, of course don't forget that it's not because you don't hear anything that you won't hear anything these are intermittent communications that means it's not always active sometimes they can actually be several hours without any activity and then it just lights up and you have uh, these stations coming in and there's tons of activity for a while and then it you know drops back down so it's worth it to really um, take a listen and um, you know one of the best ways to actually uh, listen in here is to just park yourself on one frequency here and leave it on the radio you know just put the volume a little lower and for sure at some point you'll hear some communications here so I'll uh, share this information um, on the um, on, in the uh, description below the video just click the link if you enjoy our videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching